Does anxiety or fear, for whatever reason, keep you from going to the dentist? Set your goal for this year to overcome your anxiety and commit to a healthy smile. You're going to be very excited to hear that there is a dentist who can help you overcome the fear. Dr. Maureen Toll, she is the founder of Center for Dental Rehabilitation. And I'm going to tell you something. We talk about this a lot, how important it is to take care of not only our teeth but our mouth. But if we don't, Dr. Toll, how does it affect our overall health in our body? Well, it's a terrible cycle, Terry. When you have infection in your mouth, when you don't get it taken care of, the cycle is you have pain, you can't eat, then you can't sleep. And if you cannot maintain your nutritional status, your closest neighbor is your brain. And when that happens, you have a terrible cycle that can't be broken until you go get your teeth taken care of. And the infection can set in. And once that happens, that can affect all parts of your body as well. Every part, heart, liver, lungs, every single cell in your body is adversely impacted. The oral cavity has bacteria that are anaerobic, meaning they don't need oxygen to live. So they're very strong, wow. very powerful. Okay. Heart transplant candidates need a clean mouth before they can have the heart transplant. All right, I want to talk about um, the fear and the reason why people will not go to the dentist. And I'm, you already know this, people say all the time, I don't like to go to the dentist, but some people yeah. simply can't because of the fear. And the result of that, my friendly viewers, is unbelievable. I'm going to give you a warning here. These photos you're about to see, they may be disturbing to you, but for Dr. Toll, this is reality. Tell me about this patient. He is a 77-year-old man who came to see you. Yes, he actually had um, a terrible experience as a child. Mm. He was physically restrained, and they did not give him any local <gasps> anesthetic or numbing medicine. Oh my gosh. As a consequence, he never went to the dental office. He allowed the areas where there there's no teeth he allowed these teeth to fall out it got to the point where he had so much pain so much infection that he basically said i have to find a way and he found us and he found you and yes. look what happened the results here are mm -hmm. unbelievable and i want to tell everyone that you, sometimes it takes more than one session or treatment or appointment i should say but but you put you put people under sedation you have full anesthesia an anesthesiologist mm -hmm. on staff mm -hmm. that to help people feel comfortable and, and not even be awake during this procedure. Well, when you see these photographs, you want to understand that the mouth is one organ system. Mm -hmm. So we don't want to patchwork. We don't want to do one side and then have you come back three weeks later or a month later and then do another side. Mm -hmm. our, our, our photographs show that we put the whole mouth back together again as one organ system to remove that infection, give them balancing of stresses and good function. I want to take a look at the next patient. He's a 70-year-old retired Marine, again, complete fear of dentistry and therefore look at what happened. He had a terrible experience in the military. Uh, so you have to follow their rules mm -hmm. and as a consequence he did the exact same thing. When he got out he refused. He, he, when he met us he was profusely sweating and hardly could speak to us because of the anticipated fear. Oh. When we told him we could subject him to a general anesthetic, take care of the whole mouth in that one to two settings oh he was ecstatic, changed his whole life, changed his wife, changed his children's attitudes. A lot of uh, downhill uh, positives for patients like this. Unbelievable. The next patient is a 56-year-old man. Same mm -hmm. thing, severe anxiety. Well, his parents, both parents, had dentures at the age of 21. Mm. So his fear, he saw them putting the dentures on the chair, he saw them chewing without any teeth, and he was petrified, same thing, petrified to lose his teeth. Unbelievable. Yeah, so we took care of him in three settings and this, they've and, done wonderful. And I know that you work with people who have, have anxiety, but you also work at, with a lot of people who have challenges physically, emotionally. Um, it, it's amazing, uh, really, what you do. We're looking at your surgery center here. This is all in your own office and you have your own staff. You do all yes, of this. You're the leader. Mm -hmm. Yes, ma'am. Let's call it six-handed six -handed surgery. Well, we, do si we provide six-handed dentistry because this is a lot of dentistry in one setting. Yeah. So you have highly trained, skilled uh, staff that allow us to initiate and complete things in a very predictable period of time. I, I wish we had an hour. <laughs> I really do. You're amazing and I want to give you. everybody your information because if you have any questions, any concerns at all, you need her. Call Center for Dental Rehabilitation 16620 North 40th Street. That's Building F in Phoenix 602-485-0505. Learn more at drmtoll.com. 
TOAL.com.